If you want to survive in the future, Web3 is a must. Welcome to Web3, the visionary concept that promises to transform the digital landscape. In this new era, cryptocurrencies, non fungible tokens, NFTs, decentralized autonomous organization DAOs, and decentralized finance DeFi take center stage. Web3 offers users great control over their online communities, with financial stakes in the platforms they engage with. It aims to reshape the online experience as dramatically as PCs and smartphones did. However, Web3 is not without its risks. Companies entering this space must navigate environmental concerns, financial speculation, and potential fraud while considering the benefits it brings. Cast your mind back to the first time you heard about Bitcoin. It may have seemed like a passing buzz, but over time, it became a sensation, leaving skeptics baffled as it defied expectations and surged its value. Bitcoin's rise was just the beginning as cryptocurrencies started permeating mainstream consciousness. From Larry David endorsing them during the Super Bowl to celebrities like Paris Hilton, Tom Brady, and Jamie Foxx promoting them in ads, cryptocurrencies became big business. However, it is crucial to understand that crypto is only the tip of the iceberg. Blockchain, the underlying technology, offers a distributed ledger system that revolutionizes how information is stored and shared. The advent of NFTs, DAOs, and DeFi has expanded the potential of blockchain even further, leading to the birth of Web3. Web3 represents a comprehensive reimagining of the Web's foundation. It leverages blockchain to challenge the monopoly on information control, financial systems, and network governance. Advocates argue that Web3 will create new economies, products, and services, democratize the web, and shape the next wave of the internet. However, obstacles loom on the path to Web3's success. Technical challenges, environmental concerns, ethical considerations, and regulatory issues pose significant hurdles. Skeptics caution against the speculative nature, privacy concerns, and the risk of centralization undermining the decentralized web. Amidst this rapidly changing landscape, businesses and leaders must carefully navigate the potential rewards and pitfalls of Web3. To fully grasp Web3, it's essential to understand its evolution from previous iterations of the Internet. Web1 the early Internet consisted of static pages that allowed users to navigate through the read-only web. Web2 the era of social media and user-generated content brought interactivity to the forefront. However, it also brought about centralization, with dominant companies accumulating vast wealth through user data and targeted advertising. Dissatisfaction with this system has sparked the rise of Web3. It aims to address the shortcomings of Web2 by providing encrypted words for privacy decentralized databases for transparency and user empowerment through ownership and voting rights. Web3 represents the read-write on web where users become owners, not products. With examples like Binance, Crypt.com, and Braintrust leading the church in the Web3 landscape, the potential for innovation and growth is immense. These companies offer diverse products and services 
such as digital asset exchange, centralized wallets, and talent networks, all built on the principles of blockchain and Web3. By embracing this new paradigm, businesses can position themselves at the forefront of the evolving internet and unlock new opportunities for success. NFTs or non-fungible tokens are like digital masterpieces that you can actually own. It's like having a super unique and one-of-a-kind Pokemon card. But in the digital realm, you have a fantastic piece of digital art, digital fashion, or even a virtual game item. With NFTs, you can turn these into valuable assets that can be bought, sold, and traded on the NFT marketplace. It's like a digital treasure hunt with real money rewards. The mind-blowing NFT sale. Hold on tight, because here comes the mind-blowing part. In March 2021, digital artist Beepo shocked the world when his NFT art sold for a mind-blowing $70 million in an online auction at Christie's. I mean, talk about a digital gold rush. People couldn't believe their eyes when this virtual marketplace fetched such an astronomical price. Suddenly, NFTs became the talk of every digital town. It's like turning virtual pixels into cold hard cash. Who knew art could be this lucrative in the digital realm? Introducing DAOs. Now that we've had our minds blown by NFTs, let's talk about DAOs. DAO stands for Decentralized Autonomous Organization, and it's like a business or project without a specific owner or manager. It's like a futuristic organization run by a collective of super smart robots. Unlike traditional companies, DAOs don't rely on a central authority. They are powered by the magic of blockchain technology, which ensures transparency, security, and equal decision making for all members. It's like a digital democracy, but for business. The Bitcoin example. When we talk about successful DAOs, we can't ignore the granddaddy of them all, Bitcoin. Bitcoin is like the rockster of decentralized finance. It's a global network maintained and managed by miners all around the world, with other boss telling them what to do. This revolutionary approach has made Bitcoin's market capitalization reach a jaw-dropping $350 billion. That's right, the power of a decentralized community can take you to any marginable heights. Bitcoin is like the superhero of the decentralized world, saving us from financial billions. Introducing DeFi. Now let's unlabel the mysteries of DeFi. DeFi stands for decentralized finance, and it's like financial freedom on steroids. It's a magical system that lets you transact directly with others without pesky banks, governments, or any other financial overlords. Imagine this. No more waiting in long lines at the bank. No more unnecessary fees eating up your hard-earned money. With DeFi, you can manage your finances and make transactions directly with other users. It's like having a financial adventure with other middlemen. The global wallet example. Here's a fantastic example of the power of DeFi. Imagine you want to invest in foreign markets, but the traditional way is a hassle. Opening overseas accounts, exchanging currencies, is a nightmare. But with a virtual currency wallet and DeFi applications, you can do. Thank you for watching this video. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. See you in next video. Bye.